So once you open up Canva, go to the website section here. Then there's going to be a list of templates which you can choose from. I'm going to use this one, simply drag it and drop it into the canvas. And now I'm going to make a few adjustments such as, so I typed in, what kind of property are you looking for? Afterwards, you're going to create a new tab and you're going to type in Google Form. And then you're going to sign into your Google Forms account. Then go to one of the recent forms in which you want to embed. Afterwards, you're going to go to the top right and then go to Published. And you're going to select Copy Responder Link. So you're going to right click, then select Copy. Afterwards, you're going to go back to your design. You would scroll down and then look for apps. Once you find apps, you're going to type in Embed and you're going to select the first option. And then you go to right click and then paste in the link. Then select Add to Design. Now, when you paste in the URL, you're going to get this error which says, we encountered an error with the link provided. It may be invalid or not yet supported. Please check the link and try again. Now, for some people, it does work, but in some other cases, the link does not work. So if you paste in a link and it does actually work, what you'll notice is that your form is going to appear somewhere here. So it's going to have all of your questions and then there's going to be spaces in which people can respond. But in our case, it is not working at the moment. But if it works for you, that's great. And there you go.